we are about to install nest boxes for our orcs or burks parakeets and I wanted to show you the pine shavings that we use. I have one to two inches, probably closer to two inches in here and I tamp it all down. I go through them first, I kind of run them through my hands looking for any sharp pieces of stick or hard pieces that I pull out and tamp it down. They'll get in there and move them around the way they want them, but I like to tamp it down, kind of discourage them from tossing them out. Some of my hens do that, others don't. They're just all different. There's another box over here. So all of the boxes have pine shavings and they are all of them ready for their uh, occupants. Okay, this empty bag of pine shavings is what we've just filled the boxes with. And if I run out, I've got this giant bag. And forgive the dog. Sus. My five-month-old puppy. He doesn't look five months. He looks bigger. Sasha's. You can say hello without jumping. Yeah, I know. So I have plenty of pine shavings to use. <laughs> Come over here out of my picture. So we have a bunch of them. And here are two more boxes ready to go up. This one opens in a little bit different direction. It's a smaller box, but it's just fine for them. This one below it. It is much bigger. And they enjoy them all. Hello, songster. Oh, that's Blossom. Hi, Blossom. You like your new box? Well, it's not your new box. It's your box back. <laughs> oh, Stormy. Stormy's up here wondering what's going on downstairs. And there's peaches. They have their box, which they've already been in and checked out. Now they want to know what the neighbors are doing. You guys are nosy. Yeah, you're nosy. There's our pretty blossom. You can come in and check it out. Yeah, look at there. Got your box back for 2022. Uh-huh. You can put the lid down so that you can go in where the way it's supposed to be. Where's Songster over here? Put the lid down. Hi, Songster. You get a picture of you. Let me open the door. There he is. There's our Songster bird. Songster and Blossom and their new box. Well, it's their old box returned for the season. Yeah. Songster is an opaline fallow, rosy bork with red eyes. Blossom is a lutino. That's not latino, it's lutino, which is yellow. And she's yellow and pink. Yeah, and she also has red eyes. Normal and rosy borks that are not Fallow are, they have dark eyes. But these two both have red eyes for two different reasons. One is fallow and one is an eno. Mm -hmm. Oh, you guys, we love you. Yeah, enjoy your new box or your old box returned. Hope we'll see some beautiful babies in a few weeks. Bye for now. didn't mention but Songster and Blossom are both tame birds. Okay Rosie, you know your nest box is coming, don't you? Yeah, she's on the perch waiting, very eager to have her nest box. And up here, Valentine and Sweetheart 
Hello, sweetheart. Are you happy you have a nest box? That's pretty exciting, huh? Checking it out. And Valentine's happy too. Uh huh. <laughs> You're a good boy. I love you. I love my sweetheart. There you are, Valentine. There you go, lady. Yeah, you guys you got your nest box. Rosie can't wait to see her box. Look at that. Meanwhile, nosy neighbors over here checking out, saying, what you doing? Let me see too. So Sweetheart and Valentine are checking out Rosie's box. And Rosie's checking out her box too. <laughs> what do you think, Rosie? The whole time my husband was putting it up, she was, we had to keep poking her away to quit and get her out of the way. Because she was ready to hop in there. Yeah, she says, I want this box. Okay. Alright, I'll put the lid down. You can come on in. So here we are. We have three nest boxes on four cages. So I've shown you Blossom and Songster and Stormy and Peaches. Yeah, there they are. It's my Songster and Blossom. Stormy and Peaches. Yeah, I have to give everybody clean paper now. And this is Starfire and Sunset. Yeah, you guys like your box? What do you think? Uh-huh. Where are you, Sunset? There he is. There's our guy. Yeah. The males usually check things out before the hens go in. Just to be sure everything's safe. Mm-hmm. There's our beautiful Sunset. Yeah, I guess you could call him a bronze fallow. He has red eyes. Yeah, lots of blue. You're so sweet. He's very tame. One of my favorites, if not my favorite. And Starfire, what are you squawking at me about? Huh? What? She is a Lutino. Mm-hmm. Yo, oh, you're so pretty. They're both very tame and adorable. And up here, above Sunset and Starfire, are my babies, hand-fed babies from last year. We sold over 30. And we have two little hens left. A Rosie, this little gal, and a normal up there on the perch. Yeah, I know. I love you, sweetie. Pretty girl. Pretty little Rosie. And a pretty little normal. Both are hens. And of course, over here is Glitter. Who's going to stay here? I'm trying to find a female splendid for him. What you chewed on my fingers for? You want me to bring you some treats? She says, yes, please. I'd like some, some corn checks. No, no, no. Rice checks. Never corn. What am I saying? Rice checks. Yeah, they love rice. Rice cereal squares. They don't, the generics are fine. Yeah, they love those. Yes, you do. And come back down here. And again, there's, <laughs> there's our Starfire and Sunset. 